I want to make it fun, I want to make it informative. Politics can be fun. Going for liberty, talking about truth, can be entertaining, and that's what I think we need to do more of, and we're doing a lot more of it here on The Blaze. When I became a parent, when I had my first child, it was a boy. I didn't know anything about boys, except they're dirty and they like playing with action figures. I always assumed that I would have a girl. I had a son, and I had this really jolting moment there in labor and delivery. I looked at this child and I'm like, wow, I'm responsible for this dude's life, for this young man's life. I have to raise him into, into a man. I was a big time leftist. In fact, Dana over 10 years ago would have not gotten along with Dana now. We would have been at each other's throats and Dana now would have decimated her. Totally destroyed beyond that. That just completely destroyed her. They see a lot of young women who are where I was 10 years ago and they're making these same decisions and it's a scam. Don't be scammed. I've been having so much fun with everybody putting it together and just taking these first steps. I mean, obviously I want to be informative and I want to make learning about what is happening in DC fun. I want to make it uh, inclusive. I want to uh, show people that this is not something that is a burden. You know, you have this amazing privilege to be active in civics, to be active in what's happening in your community and to have a voice nationally. I love what I do. I am so blessed that I wake up every single morning stoked about getting started. It's like waking up and getting to go to Disneyland every single day. You never get tired of riding the roller coasters. You never get tired of having cotton candy. It's just so fun. I'll knit. Um, I really enjoy reading. Um, I love just playing with my kids and going out and exploring different things. We'll go on different trips and we have a lot of fun. I like to tell people to be fearless in faith because we're always told to be fearless in absolutely everything else that we do. I really believe that if you in any fight are on God's side, that's pretty much it. I, I don't want to be on anybody else's side because that's the losing side. So that's where I get my strength and the fact that I'm super ridiculously competitive, probably more competitive than any person you'll ever meet and I want to win, so that too. I love the way that Glenn has structured the blades because he recognizes the skill set and all of these amazing people that he has brought in and puts them all in a room and magic happens. I mean, ultimately, I don't think people understand it until they actually come here and, and work here. It's unlike any other place that I've ever worked at. This is the future of media. I mean, just this is the first to, to be out on systems like Roku, to be able to, you know, uh, on-demand uh, programming, all of that. I think more and more people are going to be following the Blaze, the Blaze's format. Uh, it's, a, it's a triple threat. You have radio, you have television, you, you have uh, the web and print. Uh, so I think more industries, more outlets are going to be following the trail that has been set by this company. The hate, I make the hate work for me. I don't get intimidated, I just get even. It's punk rock conservatism. I want to have fun with it. I want to be fist in the air. You can have a good time and kick some butt. They're not mutually exclusive. Dana, Fridays at 5 p.m. Eastern. The Blaze. Truth lives here.